If you are looking for Chinese men and women who've truly mastered the craft of acting, this video is for you. While Chen Kun's striking looks may catch the eye, it's his incredible acting skills that truly steal the show. In The Rise of Phoenixes, Chen Kun dives deep into the character of Ning Yi, exploring his emotions and motivations with captivating depth. He effortlessly moves between genres, whether it's the political intrigue of Lost in 1949, the epic scope of Win the Future, or the drama of The Wind Blows from Longxi. But what truly shines is Chen Kun's talent for breathing life into his characters, infusing them with humanity and complexity. Whether he's a daring adventurer, a charismatic leader, or a charming protagonist, his performances resonate with authenticity and emotion, leaving a lasting impression. Zhang Ruoyun lights up the screen showcasing his incredible talent. From Joy of Life to Dr. Qin, Ordinary Greatness, and Under the Microscope, he's proven time and again that he's a force to be reckoned with in the acting world. Whether he's in a historical epic, a martial arts adventure, or a modern drama, Zhang commands the screen with ease, drawing viewers in with his captivating portrayals. And let's not forget his eye for great scripts. Despite not fitting the typical mold of a leading man, Zhang's talent speaks volumes, proving that true beauty lies in his captivating performances. Riza is an actress who doesn't always steal the spotlight, but she definitely steals every scene she's in. Whether she's rocking the role of the fierce concubine Ning in Empresses in the Palace, tackling the complexities of the longest day in Chang'an, or playing a relatable and heartwarming character in Minning Town, she shines bright. And let's talk about her interviews, she's got this charming self-awareness that makes watching them a real treat. Great acting, gorgeous, and she's got this drive that's totally captivating. Chen Daoming's portrayal of the Emperor in Joy of Life is truly awe-inspiring. From the moment he appears on screen, he commands attention with his powerful presence, radiating authority and strength. But Chen Daoming's talent goes beyond playing royalty. Throughout his career, he's proven himself to be a versatile actor, capable of mastering a wide range of characters. What sets Chen Daoming apart is not just his acting skills, but also his unwavering dedication to his craft. Known for his strict discipline and commitment to excellence, he's earned the respect of both his peers and audiences. His performances leave a lasting impression, cementing his status as one of the greatest actors of his time. Chen Xiao has definitely come a long way from his days in idol dramas, starring in several big hits along the journey. He was mesmerizing in Swordsman, Legend of Lu Jin, The Romance of the Condor Heroes and Nothing Gold Can Stay. Whether it's a romantic comedy or a serious historical drama, he always seems to slip effortlessly into character. And let's not forget his looks. Chen Zhao's appearance is just the cherry on top of his already impressive talent. With each new role he takes on, he continues to prove himself as a versatile actor capable of delivering captivating performances time and time again. Sun Li is a true powerhouse in the world of Chinese entertainment. In Empresses in the Palace, Sun Li's portrayal of the main character is mesmerizing. With grace and subtlety, she breathes life into her role, effortlessly capturing the nuances of her character's journey. In Legend of Miyu, she once again showcases her acting prowess, commanding the screen with power and poignancy as the titular character. And in Nothing Gold Can Stay, despite production shortcomings, Sun Li's performance shines brightly, elevating the drama with her raw emotion and versatility. It's no wonder she's received numerous accolades and awards, solidifying her status as one of the brightest stars in the industry. Hu Ji's versatility shines through in his roles in dramas like Chinese Paladin and Blossoms in Shanghai. In Nirvana in Fire, Huga skillfully conveying a multitude of intense emotions beneath a seemingly stoic exterior. As Mei Changsu, he displayed brilliance, ruthlessness, and calculation, while also revealing layers of vulnerability and self-loathing. In The Disguiser, Huga delivered extraordinary performances as Ming Tai, leaving a lasting impression on viewers. While Huga was once known primarily for his looks, he has since established himself as a talented actor. His solid acting skills and ability to fully immerse himself in his characters have earned him well-deserved recognition in the industry. Qin Hao's journey from Green Red to Harbin 1944 showcases his dedication to his craft. Each role he takes on becomes a canvas for him to paint vivid portraits of humanity's complexities. In Burning Ice he embodies Yen Liang's blend of arrogance and justice flawlessly. Similarly, as Zhang Dongxing in The Bad Kids he navigates inner turmoil with finesse, drawing viewers into the character's psyche. Qin Hao's commitment to authenticity is evident in every performance, he breathes life into his characters, making them feel real. Whether it's in The Long Season or his latest work, In the Name of the Brother, where he portrays twins with intelligence and resilience, his on-screen presence is captivating. While Zhou Sun is best known for hits like Rui's Royal Love in the Palace and Red Sorghum, Zhou Sun's talent extends far beyond. Her early 2000s dramas may fly under the radar, but it's her performances in films like Painted Skin, 
the message, and the equation of love and death that truly showcase her versatility and skill. Another thing that sets Zhou Sun apart is her captivating voice, which carries both warmth and strength. Even in roles with limited depth, she manages to infuse authenticity, making her characters feel incredibly lifelike. Whether Zhu Yan is trading clever quips or navigating intricate character dynamics, he effortlessly steals the spotlight, adding a touch of levity to the drama's darker moments. His versatility shines in roles like the one in Across the Ocean to See You, where he brings depth and nuance to a complex character. But it's his portrayal of Zhu Zhang Ji in Ming Dynasty that truly showcases his talent. From mischievous youth to jaded emperor, Zhu Yan navigates the character's journey with skill and conviction, leaving viewers eagerly awaiting his next scene. Nini's performances in dramas like The Rise of Phoenixes, Parallel World, and Love and Destiny are absolutely captivating, demonstrating her versatility and depth as an actress. While her beauty is striking, what truly sets her apart is her dedication to delivering authentic and nuanced performances. In a genre where appearance often takes precedence, Nini's commitment to portraying complex characters adds layers of depth and authenticity to her role. Whether she's portraying a man or embracing her femininity, Nini effortlessly embodies the essence of her character, bringing both realism and depth to the screen. Bai Yufan is quickly becoming a shining star in Chinese entertainment, captivating audiences with each new role he takes on. From remembrances of things past to Ripe Town and Stand By Me, his talent leaves a lasting impression with each project, Bai Yufan creates a cinematic universe all his own, inhabiting diverse characters with ease. Whether he's navigating the corporate world or teaching Jim in Xinjiang, his performances leave a lasting impact. Gong Li is like cinematic royalty, with a presence that commands attention every time she graces the screen. Her performance in Raise the Red Lantern was exceptional, showcasing her exceptional talent and charisma. Gong Li and Zhang Yimou were truly a dynamic duo. She was simply magnetic and mesmerizing on screen. The only letdown was Curse of the Golden Flower, but Gong Li's talent shone regardless. In To Live, her chemistry with Gu Yu was palpable. Gong Li's talent knows no bounds, and she continues to captivate audiences with her remarkable performances. Renowned for her role in Raise the Red Lantern, Chao Tsuifen continues to captivate audiences with her stellar performances. In recent hits like The Story of Ming Lan, Joy of Life, and Rebirth for You, Tsuifen's brilliance shines through with impeccable line delivery and enunciation. In The Story of Ming Lan, her portrayal of the Sheng family matriarch was nothing short of incredible, anchoring the drama with her immense presence. Ning Li who is known for his roles in dramas like Long Night, Ordinary Greatness, and Ripe Town. Ning Li's acting prowess lies in his ability to bring depth to even the smallest roles. While he may not be a leading actor commanding attention, his subtle performances anchor entire productions with pathos. A seasoned actor since the 90s, Ning Li's talent shines through despite his roles often flying under the international radar. His memorable calligraphy scene in Ripe Town is a testament to his ability to leave a lasting impression. Another gem is Wang Kai. You may recognize him from his roles in Nirvana in Fire, When a Snail Falls in Love, and Like a Flowing River series. He has a naturally intense presence and a unique deep voice that adds depth to his characters. Seen in dramas like Joy of Life, Gen Z, Under the Microscope and New Vanity Fair, Wu Gang is another amazing veteran actor who deserves all the praise. Last but not least, we have another great emperor. N.I. Da Hong's portrayal of the emperor in Rise of Phoenixes was refreshingly authentic, capturing the regal demeanor of imperial authority. His expressive eyes and emotional line delivery added depth to his character, making his performance truly captivating. Which great actor did I miss? Let me know in the comments.